Welcome everyone to my YouTube channel, Smoothin again, and today I'm going to solve a usable step one U word question of the microbiology block. An unvaccinated 20 month old girl is brought to the emergency department with a rash. Three days ago, she developed a fever along with cough, congestion, and red eyes. The rash appeared on her face yesterday and spread to her trunk, arms, and legs today. The patient's temperature is 39.4 Celsius, which is increased. She is lethargic and ill appearing. Physical examination shows conjunctival injection and a diffuse maculobabular erythematous rash. She is admitted to the hospital for further management. Deficiency of which of the following is associated with the high rate of complications from this patient's condition? The correct answer here is vitamin A. Because... Vitamin A can be beneficial in the treatment of measles infection by reducing comorbidities, for example, ocular complications, diarrhea, pneumonia, recovery time and the length of hospital stay. Now we're going to discuss the measles virus, which is called rubiola. The clinical manifestations include prodrome, for example, cough, coriza, conjunctivitis, fever, public spots. And those are important. Maculobabular. Uh, exanthem, cephalocaudal, and centrifugal uh, spread, centrifugal spread, spares the bulbs and sores, that's an important point. The complications include primary measles pneumonia, secondary bacterial infections, for example, pneumonia and otitis media, neurologic encephalitis, it occurs within days, acute disseminated encephalomyelitis, it occurs within weeks, and subacute sclerosing ban encephalitis, it occurs within years. The prevention is live attenuated measles vaccine. Those are my accounts and thank you for watching.